Today, we're gonna teach you that Marcelo skill. You know, the one he did in training where the ball comes, he lets it go over his head, catches it, smiles and walks away like it's no big deal. But it kinda is a big deal. But since I'm no pro, so I can't teach you that well, I brought a pro today. It's Will John. He's back. Good to see you, my man. What's up, man? Thanks for coming. All right, guys, like you said, we've got the Marcelo trick and we've got a way for you guys to spice it up and use it in the game. Let's go. All right, guys, what we want to do right now is break down this clip that we can really understand what's going on before we head out to the pitch. So as you can see, what Marcelo does, receive a nice firm pass. What he does is get set, slightly turning as the ball is coming in, shows the ball just a little bit of his cleat. And once he turns to face away, he knows that the ball is going to land right in his hands. Because once you're set, lean down with the ball showing just a little bit of your cleat, the trick is basically done and it's going to end up right in your hands. All right guys, so when you come out to the pitch and you are ready to train and practice this move, there are a few points that you need to remember. So, first off, you can't expect the ball to pop over your head if you're standing straight up or if you've got a stance like this, okay? So first things first, you're gonna wanna know that you're gonna need to lean, okay? The ball has to be played in at a good pace. If it's too soft, you're not gonna have enough power to get it over you, okay? So we wanna lean like this. The angle of our feet, okay, is what is gonna determine how high the ball flicks up over our head. So either like this, or we can edge it up and put it in like this, okay? So as soon as the ball is about to connect with my foot, you stamp it down, get it like this, get a good lean on, really believe that the ball is gonna appear right here in front of us, show you exactly how it's done. All right guys, so ideally when you come out to the field, it'd be great if you have a friend to pass you the ball. If not, all you need is a wall or a bin, something like this to pass with, okay? So some stuff that you definitely wanna avoid. First off, you don't wanna stand straight up like this. The ball is not gonna pop up. It's just gonna hit you like that and bounce right off. You can also make sure to avoid showing all of your cleats, okay? If you lean down like this, it's just gonna hit your cleat and come right back, okay? Like that, it stops, okay? What you wanna do is show a little bit of the cleats and a little bit of your toe. You wanna hit the ball around here, somewhere around there and on the bottom of your cleats and at least get it up just a little bit like this into the air right here. That's all we're trying to practice right now because if we can get it up to here in this area, getting it up and over our head is the next trick and that'll be much easier, okay? That's all we're trying to do right now. Practice that a few times, you'll be good to go. All right, guys, you can't actually catch the ball with your hands in the game, but you can use the move. And the way to do that is to lean just enough to get it to flick up in the air, use your heel, flick it over you or around you to a defender who is pressuring you quickly, just like this. So there you go, guys. That Marcelo skill that he did in training, and hopefully now you can too. Maybe even spice it up in a match like Will John taught you and pull off the trick. But guys, what should we teach you next? Just let us know in the comment section right down below. And of course, and don't forget to go follow Will to learn even more sick skills from an actual pro. Also, don't forget that if you like our boots, go cover them on unisportstore.com right down there. And finally, go learn some more skills from us right down there. With that said, guys, we're signing off. Cheerio.